Schema breaks Blink tradition by singing most of Blood, Hair, and Eyeballs. Does it work for our cursed ears? Find out in this review. I saw in comments on the internet that we were not ready for Hot for Preacher, which starts with millennial woe o and follows with Boys Will Be Poisoned which is great. That is just an incredible lyric right there. The electric shredding guitars and a vocal delivery from Matt Skiba that really hits hard, hits close to home. Meet Me has an almost classic Alkaline Trio sound, like way back in the day, but with 2024, I can kind of already recognize the vibe we're getting um, from this new year. And I think this is a, a new sound from Alkaline Trio, even though I did hear echoes of, you know, first, second records. Keyboards join the mix on this one too, um, with a nice mellow Alkaline track. Alkaline Trio craft a heavy metal rift on versions of you. <laughs> Sorry about that. And it's one of Dan's uh, only songs on the record. And while I was not crazy about versions of you when it came out, as straight, it's really erected to be a grower. The juiciest singles from the album and Alkaline Trio in a bad time is Bad Time. And it's got everything I want from a song. It's got everything I want from music. This is what I want music to sound like and I cannot praise Bad Time enough. It's melodic, it's heavy. I think there's some guitars and, and, and vocals in the mix too. And Matt singing about bulletproof robots and harmonies, those harmony vocals with Jamie Blake. I'm, I'm reading this, Jamie Blake, who I'm interested in learning more about. She worked with The Rentals and uh, she's done some amazing uh, musical work over decades. Oh, and she is on not just this song, but four songs on Blood, Hair, and Eyeballs. So definitely check her out, look her up. I think she's got an album from 1997 that is probably worth checking out. So let's check it out after this. Clean Guitars and Dan Andriano, is that how you say that? Are all that I need. But a new scar is good too. I've got a bunch of scars. Scars soars where other songs slither and this is a bouncy bop and it's one of Dan's best songs of his career, of Alkaline Trio's career. Church Bells are next on the one word song that's on Break. And Break is a good morning track if I've ever heard one. The best possible tones of gothic feelings and sensitivity mesh onto Matt Skiba's tongue. When we fall apart, you'll be there. Some deep stuff. Shake With Me retains the redness that I'm feeling across this album but with a groove that's fresh for Alkaline Trio's catalog. And the title track never mentions blood, hair, and eyeballs, but it implies a bad split, a good time. What am I talking about, man? Blood, hair, and eyeballs. It's a great title for the record. The music contained here within this coffin just feels darker and uh, shades of shades of red, maroon, crimson, like a tender heart in a blender. Yeah, I know that's the wrong punk rock band, but man, it just worked here. You catch my garlic. I'm so famous, stupid and contagious. I'm not crazy. You're the one that's great. Wait, wait, that's ha. I am not famous. I'm famously anti-interlude, and that's what I meant to say. No fancy sauce needed. Okay. Hinterlude. What the hell is a hinterlude? Please tell me in the comments what a hinterlude is. Because hinterlude proves that Alkaline Trio indeed have time to waste and they should be sorry. I didn't quite mail that, mail that melody, but I tried to nail that melody. 
I want my one minute and six seconds back, Alkaline Trio. If you could please give that back. But I guess this interlude, interlude, does bridge the gap between the title track and the broken down time machine, which is a poetic monster waxed out of Dan Andriano's body. Whoa. Whoa. And made into essence somehow as the album ends with Matt Skiba. Skiba? Singing about sunrises and sunsets and everything feels metallic and red within my soul. Like an Alkaline Trio album just kind of like wrapped me in its tongue and spit me out. 11 songs clocking in at 35 minutes. This is a brisk but smart record that really knows how to set the mood and the mood is a distressing yet enjoyable journey through a 4.2 out of 5 record. Matt Skiba breaks tradition. Matt Skiba ble Matt Skiba breaks Blink-182 tradition by singing on most of Blood, Hair, and Eyeballs. Does it work here for our cursed ear? Matt Skiba sings 